What is up guys, Euclid back here with you again and welcome back to my let's play of Halo Reach. When last we left off, we actually just got done playing the first mission, Winter Contingency. So it's exciting to be here again playing another Halo game all the way through and it's exciting to be here with you again guys. It's also exciting to see Bungie back when they were Bungie. So don't hate me for skipping that, but I'm not going to watch it every single time. Maybe every other time, just because I do enjoy it, but we'll uh, jump away from that for there. I actually was going to record this a second ago, but I had a little bit of a... Oh, I'm logged out already. For some reason, it gives me issues when I'm logging into Halo Reach, so we won't worry about that. Well, campaign. Second mission, only sword based on heroic, no skulls, not going to mess with it. And we can go ahead and uh, jump into this. The game is loading, so it'll take a second. Is that really our second mission? Yeah. Contingency. Money. Well, here we go. Resume solo campaign. Boop. Ready to go, then? Okay, good. God, I'm having so many issues getting back to where I was with the save and quit and restart and all that stuff. That plan in the background is crazy looking. I really did like Reach's skyboxes. The artwork done for the background for Reach I thought was awesome. Good old Spartan 2 George. Sword base. Be advised, Kilo 33 three and Kilo 34, your current LZ is too hot. Roger that. Dot, stand by to receive a response. Yes, Commander. Coordinates received. Initiate immediate course correction. The Office of Naval Intelligence Sword Base is presently under siege from a Corvette class Covenant vessel. Due to the sensitive nature of this facility, use of orbital rounds has been, for the moment, prohibited. Regrettably, my efforts to obtain relevant data on enemy forces have been unsuccessful. However, current defensive forces are insufficient. Oni has requested Team Noble's direct intervention to help secure Sword they Base. They don't talk about the airfield that was next to Sword Base, too, and its significance. Alright, people. We're stuck with that ship for the time being. Let's focus on the hostile infantry. Give those troopers a hand. Cat 6, you're out here. George Emil, you're next. Get prepped. Let's move, Lieutenant. Grab your assault rifle, jackass. I get the whole pistol thing, but I... Alright, I think that's looking a little better than when I was playing last. I finally wired up my Xbox. Plasma grenades. You've got enemy contact, Spartans. Oh, fuck. Oh. All right, check out a San Healy Major. <laughs> yep, overcharged shot. Jackal protecting his boy. Little did they know the little bastards would betray them Six. later on. Push back the attack on sword base. Find out what we're dealing with. Roger that. Bring a strike team. Spartans, hostiles north. Knock some heads, Lieutenant. We've got enemy contact. 
Spartans. Oh boy. All right, reloading assault rifle. Dead Marines everywhere. You gotta kill this guy. They always beat your ass, especially when they got that concussion rifle. Alrighty. Six. Push Let's try this a third time. Find out what we're dealing with. Roger that. Bring your strike team. Spartans, hostiles north. Let's knock some heads, Lieutenant. <laughs> Jesus Christ! I'm getting my ass beat by these guys. Plasma rifle shoots so slow in this back game. The attack on sword base. Find out what we're dealing with. Roger that. We're gonna strike thing. Spartans, hostiles north. Knock them head, Lieutenant. Enemy reinforcements! Jesus Christ. I'm almost getting a headache from all the concussion rifle rounds. Like, the, that elite is like gyrating left and right to dodge my needles. Sweet Six. Jesus. Push back the attack on I do feel like it looks better Find since we wire the connection. Away. Screw wireless. Roger that. Bring a strike team. Ah. Fuck you. Oh yeah. is down. Oh boy. They move so damn much in this game. I might just be a shitty player. Okay, that's it. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. 
Oh my fucking god, they skirmishers. Little assholes. Six. Push back the attack on sword base. Oh my Find god! The asshole with the concussion rifle is the one that needs to die. Okay. Picking off Kick Yar. Okay, he's down. Okay. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Oh! Thank you. Thanks, Cat. Way to be a bitch again. She always either kills you or drives Six. you into oblivion. Push back the attack on sword base. Okay. Find out what we're dealing with. Roger that. Bring a strike team. Memories are coming back to me, including the shitty ones. Spartans, hostiles north. So many, so few needles that you can have. Die, bitch. You've got Good to God, y'all. Get out of here. Get it. Ah, so hot. He's a fucking asshole. I'm getting a plasma pistol. I'm going to shoot him in the fucking head. That's it. Six. Push back the attack on sword base. Find out what we're dealing with. <laughs> Guys, get a witness how shitty I actually am at Halo. Marines on all sides. You've got enemy contact, Spartans. Come on now. God, that was aggressive. Why? Any of the ultras are beating everybody's ass. <laughs> oh, yes, he's down. That's 
one thing I like about the jackals here is the armor I'm seeing them wearing. Just the pauldrons and greaves and shit. It almost has like the same uh, look to it as the uh, clones in the Clone Wars and Star Wars. I'll show you what I mean here in a second. Shut up. Look at those. Like, look at them. I love it. Would you just look at it? I forgot about this! Vroom vroom, bitch! Ordinance. Noble two to sword control. Courtyard is clear. Oh boy. Head for the main gate to the east. I'll brief you as you go. Sword control. I see a target located. Any artillery support in the area? Limited, but we'll prioritize whatever you need, ma'am. Three Echo five seven, headed back to base. We got enemy tangles on our six. How cop? Six, use the target to locate on that race. <laughs> ah! Every single time. The target locator is slow and clumber cumbersome. In some cases, you'd probably be better off not even messing with it. Limited, but we'll prioritize whatever you need, ma'am. Three Echo 57, headed back to base. But we've got enemy tangles on our six. How cop? Contact! <laughs> Over. Over. Oh my goodness. Use the target on that range. Okay. I see it, I see it. <laughs> no Gotcha, bitch. I remember there is something up here of value. Yes. Oh, and a good looking pelican at that. I got the gun. The old Farragut station has its own comms array. That should bring us back online. There we go. Code. Airview base has an anti air battery that will help clear the skies. All yours, hey, hey, gun is to the west, comms array is to the east. Let's roll. Hey, appreciate it. Ooh, cushy. There we go. All right, let's go and get our DMR real quick. I figure having Cat as the gunner is better since she's pretty much invulnerable, which, well, she just is, really. And uh, having him wield the rockets isn't a bad idea because at least it's going to add some extra firepower. That's what I was looking for. All right, let's do this. A lot of Marines survived. That's good. You pretty much got to decide which way you want to go, but the order is up to you. I think this. Go for the gun. We go up here. What this? Forgot about this. The <laughs> little e-brake. Ha ha. Close to the AA gun. 
I love it because there's all these guns, but they're like out of operation, and there's a Corvette just bombarding the bombarding the area, bombarding the area, bombarding. That's the gun over there. Should be a reset control somewhere to get it online. Oh no! <laughs> Get him! Get him! Get him! Keep hitting him! Can we turn on this, uh... Ah, get him! Oh, Bubba boy. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Got his ass. Keep firing. Got him. Moving in. Fire. This warthog is fucked. He just took out another uh, ray. No, turret, turret. Can we get the. Can we destroy this phantom? Not wraith, I said wraith. I meant phantom. Go to the tower first, see what we have. Any health? Got sniper rifle ammo. I'd rather have sprint in this game. If I have to have some kind of stupid power up, it might as well be sprint. Dead and massacred marines everywhere. They were slaughtered. I like how there's like littered dead elites and marines everywhere. Wait, what down here? We need to activate that AA gun. I know, shut up. I want to check everything out first, cat. Stop rushing me. There we go. Oh. Such a weird and interesting weapon. There we go. Nice. That CD6. AA gun is online. <laughs> nice work, Spartans. Head to Farragut Station and get that comms array up and running. Well, she's in Spartans, one. Maybe they'll drop more Marines for this Welcome Warthog here. Mobile firepower. Always. Take that, Hog Six. Get this tin can moving. Oh, Jesus Christ. She's gonna have to come with me, huh? All yours. Let's move out. All right. I've got the no! Don't hop out! Jump in. All right, screw it. Oh, you are. Yeah, you do. This, this Marine's gonna just drive the Warthog into enemies until he explodes, and he will explode 
It happens all the time. It's about the best thing we can do. The controls and reach for the Warthog are really wonky. There we go. Ha <laughs> What a dirty mess. What a mess we've made, kids. Here we go. Alright, well that's settled there. Yeah, I'm definitely get the vibe for for Halo. Even though the crazy thing is we're on reach. Has a working generator. Let's search the area for generators. I want that. Too bad. <laughs> I love Revenants. They're fun. Baby Wraith. Full sniper ammo. Heavy drop ships all the way. Icky birds. Ah, pretty tough. <laughs> Fuck you. All righty. Let's go up here and see what we can find. Stowed away in this. Oh yes. Rest in peace, brother. Alrighty. I'm a derp. He's like, ah, it's killing all of us. <laughs> There we go. Did it six. Comes away up and running. Noble strike. This is Noble Leader. Get back to short base ASAP. On our way, Commander. Gauss Hog, you're off. Good work, Spartans. Return to short base. The rest of your team is inbound, imminent. Alright, let's do this. We got two warthogs. Feeling pretty good about it. Noble, be advised. Company Corvette moving into position. Cat, six. Get here quick. We'll meet you inside. Holy shit, where'd that a grunt even come from? Oh, 
Holy fuck. That ended well. What a hot fucking mess, dude. Did they kill all of our Marines already? Or is that all that remains? Ah, uh, come here. Come here. Boots on the ground. Feral little guy. Boots on the ground. Let's do it. I'm driving. We're stalled in the solid atrium. Cat, where are you? Opening the gates now. On in, dude. I'm on. In position. Arm my Marines a little better, maybe. Hold oh, still, you fucker. I suck at sniping. <laughs> All righty. I can't see him. Are there other Marines up here? Oh no! Just an asshole. Let the Sanahili buckle. That sudden smack, I get that they're fast, but I kind of miss how they used to be in C. There we go. All right. Double bullshit sprint, I swear. So this is where enemies started getting real fast. When they wanted to kill you, they just had that advantage. Can't hide from me. Alrighty. Try this a fifth time. The count's probably slightly off, but it sure feels like it's been a lot.
Every fucking time I try to jump over the fucking crate. Okay. Let me shoot this guy a third time. Oh, God. Fight me, bitch. Oh, yeah. This. Oh, fucking Christ. Not surprised that happened. Woo! Woo! Let's get to the atrium. We have to go through the security office. That was bound to happen eventually. Elevator, Lieutenant. Take it. There we go. About to say, can I use my health, please? The Office of Naval Intelligence. This is where the Marines were holding out. Fuck yeah. Alright, here we go. Time to clear sword base. Cat's bionic arm. That's another cool thing they introduced into Halo is seeing missing limbs being replaced by working movable appendages, and that was just, I don't know. Mostly unheard of. Thanks. I doubt that very much. I'm in cover. Circuit rooms and server rooms. All right, one floor at a time. Clearing sword base. George. Six. Head upstairs and assist the meal. Totally forgot about this part. There's all these gunshots raging throughout sword base, and that just goes to show you that humans weren't that easy to take out. Holy fuck! There are marines fighting in all different parts of this level. And it was good to feel that way again, feel like the battles were bigger. Here we come! Fuck you. Can't do this on my own. I Get know. Spartan up here. Six. Get to the top floor and assist the meal. Oh fuck! Hi. A lot of Marines. Oh. 
God damn. So many enemies. It's lagtastic. Oh, fuck! We came out of nowhere, the general did. So angry. Six, get to the top floor and assist the meal. Oh, fuck. Look out, dudes! Oh, so stupid. Why would you just stand there? That's a fuel rod gun. I will not be partaking in any of that. No, thank you. Hey, hello! Hello there! I know what they're trying to do and it terrifies me because I know they know that I know. Minutes working session, Committee of Minds for Security. As the likelihood of the existence of extra solar intelligence is non-zero, let us assume that existence is quantifiable. To build useful models based on that assumption, the Committee must answer the following questions. What is the likelihood these intelligences are alpha predators? What they are... Oh, shit. That they are more advanced than our creators? That they are too alien to establish communications? Of course. If the extra solar intelligence is a benevolent and or non-spacefaring, its existence is irrelevant. Indeed, any further speculation on possible cultural characteristics is a waste of assembly resources. Therefore, our models will additionally assume intelligence as alpha, alpha predator, same as our creators, technology that far outstrips our creators, desire to communicate but only to dictate terms. Not to make these assumptions is tantamount to suicide. Commander, the space won't survive under the salvo from that Corvette. Kill those banshees. Taking enemy fire! Upstairs, Lieutenant. We need those long swords in the air. Well time. Every time that turret beats my ass. Gotta say those turrets are amazingly powerful. I would like to believe that both the spirits and phantom dropships have the ability to like choose what kind of ammo they have. Right. Keep shooting over six. Watch that low. That was a spec ops, San Healy. Oh, fuck you. One shot. Oh, he's laughing at me, you bitch. He was laughing at me. How? How? Oh my god. Right. 
think the guards. Down low. It's giving us more and more rockets. Yes. Right. Noble team, long swords are inbound and ready to push. Orbital defense is standing by. Let's see it. Shot. Take that Corvette down. Here we go. I love this part. <laughs> Beautiful, ain't it? Someone should take a picture. Nice work, by the way. I aim to please. Five, six, get down to the science wing. Dr. Halsey wants a debrief and command saying we're all hers. Repeat. Sounded like you said Halsey. I did. Copy that on our Halsey. way. Halsey! Don't need command to tell me. Been all hers half my life. Love George for that. He's your bro. I requested your assistance, Commander, and do not need a report on events that occur on my own doorstep. What I do require is a detailed account of your previous engagement. George, it's been too long. Mom. What have you done with my armor? <laughs> Just some additions I've made. Indeed. Visegrad relay. Its data center was home to one of my Xeno-archaeologists, Professor Laszlo Sorvad. Perhaps you could shed some light on his death. If he was a civilian male in his mid-sixties, he died with a Covenant energy sword through his abdomen. Elites, then. They engaged us as well. It was just, uh, just after we found your scientist's daughter, Mom. She was hiding in the... Irrelevant. Uh... The elites. Tell me more about them. Three. Zealot class. One got bias. The leader, from the looks of him. Zealot. You're certain? Their armor configuration matched. Shield strength, too. I gave the order not to pursue. Our primary objective was to get the station's relay back online. Your primary objective? Commander, are you a puppet or a Spartan? Ma'am? There are those at Oni, myself included, who believe the Covenant dispatch elite advanced teams is so to hunt down artifacts of value to their religion. Not to be mean, Survivor but kind of meh suggests looking. such teams are small, nimble, and almost always zealot class. No doubt they came to the station for the abundance of Oni excavation data stored there. And you let them get away. Data retrieval was not a command directive. Even had we known, we had other more urgent matters to attend to. Like warning the planet. Professor Sorvad's final entry in his field notes made reference to a latchkey discovery. Latchkey. Not a word he would use lightly. So let's hope that the data module your lieutenant commander stole contains it. He's got like yeah. smoker lips Before in this you game. Ask, I was alerted the moment you attempted to access its contents, as I am with any unauthorized tap. That data is classified Tier 1. I could send you to the brig for interfering with my work. Maybe you'd like to join her. I'm sorry? We're currently under emergency planetary directive. Winter contingency? I'm sure you're familiar with the punishment for civilian interference with the Spartan deployment. Are you threatening me, Commander? Just making a reading suggestion, ma'am. <laughs> Let's move, that's, noble team. That's why I like Carter. He doesn't let her push him around. Mom? That will be all, George. They all called her mom. All the Spartan twos. That was a thing. With with a lot of them. Not not all of them, but with a lot of them. Just called her mom. Because it's the closest thing they had to one. At least at the time.
Well, all right, guys. That was the that was definitely a better uh, playthrough than the first mission. I think it just reminds me. Only sword base is a reminder of how, even though the phenotype is ugly as hell, donning that awesome armor for a reason. The sand Healy and Halo Reach absolutely will tear you in half, as they did. Because I I suck. You clearly saw that. That was pretty bad gameplay on my part. Excuse me, but I don't really. I don't really feel bad for it just because the fact that it's been, I played, it's been a long time since I played Reach. It's been all since the last game night I hosted before starting this Let's Play. Uh, that's how long it's been, so that's fun. But guys, what did you think of the video? Did you like it? If you did, leave a like. If you did not, leave a dislike. But I ask for a favor if you do. Leave a reason why. And if even if you liked it and you think I can improve in some way, tell me how. Tell me what I'm doing that you feel like I could be doing better or what I could be doing alternatively to make this channel better. This channel is a collaboration of what you guys have told me. It's literally a creation by you all that is ran by me. So think about it that way. So guys, next we'll be moving on to the mission Nightfall, which is kind of an ode to the truth and reconciliation. So I'll be playing more so of a sniper slash stealth, stealth mission with June. It's not super stealthy, kind of like truth and reconciliation can be. I think that Halo Combat Evolved has the best stealth gameplay of any Halo game, period. But that's just because of how chill and laid back the game is. Not to mention the music. Ugh, the music's amazing. So, Moving on, guys, we will be on Nightfall, and the next time I'll probably try to record that tomorrow, because I know I had kind of a break in days between these two Reach Let's Plays, but life is busy, job is busy, busy is busy. So until next time, guys, this has been Halo Reach, I am Euclid, and I will see all of you Spartans and you Sanhili in the next video. 